Welcome to Designing Spaces of Hope with the Boys and Girls Club. I'm Debbie Marie. Today, we've got part one of a two-part show. It's a Designing Spaces of Hope, and this time, we visit the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County at the Pompano Beach facility, where we have brought in some sponsors to lend a helping hand. Now, I actually had the opportunity to get in on some of the action, and I can tell you, that everyone who helped, it was greatly appreciated. So if you wanna see what you can do for your kids, just like what's being done, then stick around and see it right here on Designing Spaces of Hope at the Boys and Girls Club. If the kids will be building things in the wood workshop with their new toolkit, there is one other skill they're gonna need, math skills. So Designing Spaces got together with the good folks at Texas Instruments to engage school kids in math and science at the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. They really brought along some fantastic educational tools. Take a look at this. The Boys and Girls Clubs are on a mission to inspire young people to realize their full potential as productive, responsible, and caring citizens. Here at the Pompano Beach facility, kids are engaged in a wide range of educational activities. And now, something new is about to be added with the help of Texas Instruments. As Texas Instruments, we want to inspire more young people to achieve in math and science. A lot of students don't feel like they're good at math or they don't have much confidence in math. And we want to work with the homework helpers here at the Boys and Girls Club to change that. And we believe TI technology can play a part in making that happen. Science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or STEM education, is more important to today's students than ever. And that's because STEM occupations are growing at double the rate of the overall labor force. More of today's jobs and more of the future jobs are going to require strong analytical skills, strong problem solving skills, and critical thinking. And using TI Inspire technology is a way for young people to build and strengthen these skills. We developed TI Inspire first by looking at the research that was available on how students best learn math and science. We took those learnings and designed and created the product from that knowledge. We've really focused the technology on where it can lead to breakthroughs in learning for young people. We want young people to be able to choose the technology that they learn best with. So we offer the TI Inspire solution as a graphing calculator, as computer software, and as iPad apps. An area of the facility is selected where the students can spend time doing homework, improving their math and science skills, and understanding and even prepping for exams like the SAT and ACT. The TI Inspire CX graphic calculators can be used on these and other important exams, and TI provides free online test prep resources to help students prepare. To serve as our guide, Tom Reardon, an award-winning math educator with 30 years classroom experience, joins in to help at the new TI Inspire Math and Science Learning Lab. The impact that graphing calculators bring to math and science classes is huge. Uh, when I taught earlier in my career without technology, I was having pretty much all the fun. I was doing all the work, the students were just watching. And as you know, students learn a lot more by just doing it, or explaining it, or experiencing it. And with graphing calculators, you can do that. The benefits for students being able to use this technology for their homework, both at home and here at the Boys and Girls Club, is tremendous. TI Inspire CX technology is appropriate for math and science, I think, at all grade levels, from middle school all the way through college. And it's also approved on the AP and SAT exams, not only to take the test, but also to prepare for it. This technology is so different from other tools that I've used in the past. I love graphing calculators. I used them for many years. But this does all those things and goes way beyond that. 
Today's students are very comfortable with technology and actually find technology attractive and engaging. So we've outfitted the learning lab with graphing calculators, with computer software, and with our iPad app. Texas Instruments provided this TI Learning Lab to help your students with their homework. Well, I would like to say thank you. Sure. I, I wanted to show you a little bit about them. Okay. First of all, we've got 30 TI-inspired graphing calculators, color handhelds, uh -huh. and this one's hooked up with a, a, a temperature probe that allows students to be able to collect data and then analyze the data. We can do some science simulations on it. Inspire Now can be done on the TI-inspired apps for iPads. And here we have a picture of Energy Skate Park, which is one of our science simulations. Mm -hmm. And what you can do is actually touch and move and watch how the kinetic and potential energy oh, change. Man. We also provided software in your computer labs for the students to be able to work with this. Okay. And here we have a geometry problem where students can grab a point and go from triangle to parallelogram. This donation definitely allows us to to level the playing field because they have they utilize these same programs at school. And we say thank you again. Okay, you're very welcome. How many of you know about area theories? Like area triangle, area parallelogram, area rectangle. You've heard those words before, right? Okay. Who knows what this yellow thing is called? You know what that's called? What's that called? Parallelogram. That's that's a dead word we use if you're off the map. If you would turn on your handheld calculators, press the home on button. This is a scientific calculator. See what the keypad and number pad and all that sort of thing? Okay. I want you to count how, how long the base is by the dots. Is the base for the yellow the same as the base for the blue? at school so I hope we have them because it, it makes us doing our homework really easy and we learn really quickly. I think playing with it was pretty cool. I thought it was pretty cool. It's a um, very easy way to learn. I think when I come in here it's going to help me with math a lot more. This will make math homework fun. The math lab that you guys are putting into our homework room actually It'll be a great opportunity for our kids to use the calculators and to be able to have that source of help with their math programming. By you putting in this math lab area, the members will be able to do their homework in a more efficient manner. They'll have the calculators available when they need them. We're looking very forward to continuing our relationship beyond today with the Boys and Girls Club here. To learn more, visit TIinspire.com. These websites will be linked to designingspaces.tv. Click on the Texas Instruments video to see this portion of the show again. Looks like things got off to a good start, but there's much more. Be sure to see part two of our Designing Spaces of Hope at the Boys and Girls Club. I'll see you soon. I'm Debbie Marie. Bye-bye.